Marin Cilic. First of all, let me ask you, are there any small Croatian tennis players? <laughs> well, uh, outside of top 100, yes, but in, in the top 100, not really. Uh, I mean, this, uh, we have this kind of generation where uh, all of us are pretty tall and uh, everybody is making jokes about us, which uh, we always find funny, so it's, uh, it's, uh, it's always a good, uh, good team when we are around and uh, we, don't, we don't need to look down with our heads. <laughs> I know Goran Ivanisevic was, uh, was a boyhood hero of yours. Can you tell me about the first time you, you met him and what your uh, memories are of that? Uh, first time I uh, saw him playing was uh, when he was playing one exhibition against Thomas Muster, close to my hometown. And uh, I was a ball boy there at that time when I was eight. And then the, the first real impression I got was uh, in 2002, 2003, when. Uh, when I was uh, in Zagreb practicing, and he was in that age where, uh, at that time, when he was finishing his career, so he was uh, helping me a little bit, practicing with me, and uh, he also introduced me to to my present coach, Bob Brett, which was his coach at, uh, at his beginning of his career. So it was a really nice time with him, and uh, he always. Uh, was a good guy and always wanted to help, so I'm really grateful to him. How would you assess your 2009 season so far? You've uh, won two titles in Chennai and Zagreb and round of 16 at the Australian and, and French. Um, are you, uh, you happy with your season so far? I am, I am happy with the season. I can't say that I'm uh, not happy, especially with the beginning of the year where I had a really good run. Uh, winning Chennai, playing fourth round of Australia, and then winning Zagreb after, and uh, also uh, winning at uh, Croatia for our Davis Cup team. And I had some pretty good results, but uh, maybe after the when the clay court season started, I was uh, a little bit uh, on and off. Even as a junior, did you have a very uh, free-swinging, aggressive game? Uh, I would say I was always more all-round player with, okay, with solid service with my height and uh, I would say I'm moving pretty good for my, uh, for my height too and uh, have some, some really good shots but I think the, the game didn't change so much, so much. I uh, just got a little stronger and uh, with, that, with that capabilities uh, the shots are of course a little bit better. And would you say that you've got the game that potentially could take you into the top ten, top five? Because with a big game like yours, you do have the weapons to beat the big guys like a yeah. Federer or a Nadal. Uh, I think my game is, uh, is good enough to, to be there. Just, uh, I think, uh, mental part and uh, also physical part can, uh, can improve that too.